guys, I'm Mara Schiavocampo, and here are the hottest pop news stories buzzing online right now. We begin with major news out of Hollywood. Jennifer Aniston and Justin Thoreau are married. People Magazine has confirmed that the celebrity couple tied the knot on Wednesday at their home in LA. Friends and family were apparently told they were attending a birthday party for Justin, but then, surprise, the couple exchanged vows. Congratulations to the newlyweds. Yeah, nice try, Jesse. Well, it seems Taylor Swift has one very unexpected super fan, singer-songwriter Ryan Adams. And he's not just a regular Swifty. Adams is so excited about the Bad Blood singer that he's creating a track-by-track -track cover version of Taylor's hit album, 1989. Right? Well, because they're, quote, badass tunes. Here's his version of Welcome to New York. Looks like the love is mutual with Taylor responding to the news, I'm not going to sleep tonight or ever again. We can't wait to hear the whole album. And get ready for another stampede, a few more creepy vines, the revenge of a murderous safari hunter, and round two of the world's scariest board game. That's right, Jumanji is coming back. Sony Pictures has finally confirmed their reboot of the classic 1995 film starring Robin Williams. Now, no word yet on any casting choices, but the new Jumanji is slated to hit theaters Christmas Day of next year. How's that for some appropriately timed Throwback Thursday news? We did good. And finally, they say it's the simple things in life that mean the most, and that's definitely the case for little Rose the Boston Terrier. All she needs to be happy, an orange balloon and a little bit of open space. Keep it up, Rose, literally. If only a single balloon would entertain my dog that well. <laughs> well, I'll be sure to tune into GMA for more pop news tomorrow. For ABC News, I'm Mara Schiavocampo in New York. Have a good one.